Hey, welcome to this week's episode of Tasting the City. And don't forget, press the little button down there and subscribe. We appreciate it. And that way you won't miss a single episode of Tasting the City. And today we're going to have all American food. That's right, we're going to a pizza parlor. What's more American than pizza? Actually, this parlor is named, what is it? Madison Avenue, which is in New York. And you would think that they might have New York pizza here. And they do. And they also have Chicago pizza here. But I digress. Let's let them tell us. So let's go in and take a look. I think I smell pizza. Matter of fact, I know I smell pizza. <laughs> hey. I got a nice hot pizza here for you. Holy moly! <laughs> that, is that the small one you've got? Uh, well, Sean, sit down, have a seat. Absolutely. Uh, love to. Hey, the old famous, tell me about this. <laughs> We're outside, so we can social distancing here. It's six feet. I think it's six feet. Close enough. Holy moly! Now. What, what am I getting ready to dive into here? Well, that's our, uh, that's our hand-tossed 18-inch New York-style pizza uh, with uh, pepperoni, mushroom, and sausage. Oh. Most uh, traditional combinations there are. That's pretty much. That, that is spot on, spot on. Now, so I just grab a little piece of this. this. Jump right in. Sean, why don't you introduce yourself? Um, well, I'm uh, busy. Uh, <laughs> trying to feed my face. <laughs> well, I'm, yeah, I'm Sean. I uh, own Madison Avenue Pizza with my wife, and we've been doing this for uh, for about three years now. And uh, this is our this is our specialty: uh, hand tossed New York style pizza, reasonably thin crust. Uh, you know, everything everything made in house, from scratch. This is good. This is really appreciate good. <laughs> this is really good. Yeah, I appreciate that. Oh man. So. Tell me, tell me about your restaurant. Where'd you get the idea for this? I mean, pizza is kind of an all-American thing. Yeah, I mean, I've just I've been cooking my whole life. Um, literally grew up uh, working in restaurants, and my wife and I wanted to uh, wanted to build our own restaurant. And uh, you know, we looked at things that we love and things that I know how to do, and uh, this was one of them. So uh, we both kind of decided on pizza, and you know, here we are. Now you mentioned the crust and flipping it and rolling it and stuff like that. How did you learn to do that? Uh, well, I, I worked in a pizzeria when I was younger and, uh, you know, really kind of, you know, cut my teeth there. And then, um, you know, as far as our recipes and everything like that, um, you know, I just kind of built them all ourselves or myself. So, you know, we, uh, we developed all these recipes and, and our style and did a lot of testing and, you know, and, uh, and this is what we came up with. So this is true New York style, right? So when you pick it up, it flops. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah well, I, I'm a Chicagoan. You guys should know that. And Chicago pizza, when you pick it up, it's straight out. Yeah. But New York, you, it, yeah. it's, I call it's, it floppy pizza, but you guys like to roll it up even. Yeah. You know, usually you uh, kind of give it the old uh, the in half fold. And that'll... Uh, kind of like that? Uh, more, more usually like a V. Like a V. A lot of times. Yeah. A lot of times people fold it like a V. There you go. Oh, okay. And that's... Uh, yeah, because you know it's an 18-inch pie, so the, the slices are considerably larger than than what a chain restaurant. Oh my might goodness! Have. This is really good, and this is your small size, right? 18 inches. We do a 14 inch as well, but <laughs> but uh, the 18 inch is what what's typically usually most people order. This is great pizza. The crust is that. wonderful. I don't Appreciate know if you can that. see the crust here. It's just got enough little brown on it to get a little crunch to it. Yeah, we we bake in a uh, we bake in a, a stone oven, a stone deck oven that that's uh, just under 600 degrees, uh, and we bake right on the stone, so it gives it that you know nice brown char, and uh, you know it gives it that that kind of crunchiness. Oh man, this is delicious! I appreciate now, that. Tell tell me about yeah, this recent unpleasantness we've been going through. <laughs> yeah, notice we're wearing face masks inside. We're outside now. We don't have to wear face masks, but. T tell me about the changes you guys had. What was it like when you first shut down? Oh, when man. the world first shut down, I should say. It was uh, it was crazy. I mean, it really, really was crazy. Uh, we um, we had to close our dining room. Uh, we had to reinvent our whole business. I mean, you know, we we did a lot of dining room business that that we lost. Um, but you know, some uh, some good came of it. Um, I was actually we shifted our whole focus to delivery and takeout, 
and I uh, was actually able to employ some people that got laid off. Uh, so some of them we actually retained uh, when everybody went back to work. And, uh, and we just shifted, you know, we shifted gears into delivery. We turned our dining room into a delivery uh, center <laughs> and just, uh, and that's, that was everything. We just, you know, push delivery, push delivery. Um, you know, it was, uh, it was different, but you know, when you're an entrepreneur, when you, you have your own business, you got to be flexible and, you know, look for the brighter side of situations. And, and that was good. You know, we, uh, we gave away toilet paper, uh, which uh, got us in the paper a couple times. <laughs> I, I remember that. I remember that. You guys did a little help out to the city and, and our heroes out there too, correct? We did. Yeah, we gave away a lot of pizza. I mean, we really did. Uh, you know, we dropped pizzas off at the, uh, the COVID unit at Morton Plan. Uh, we gave pizzas to the, uh, we actually gave a discount to first responders. Um, you know, the sheriff stations right across the street, we gave them uh, pizza. We uh, Dunedin Fire Department. I mean, we really uh, we we gave away a lot of pizza. I mean, there were a lot of people that were uh, working around the clock to yeah, keep everybody safe. Yeah, you know, and uh, and we tried to give back as much as we could to them. Yeah, I noticed you had some uh, hand sanitizer there too. Another Dunedin fine Dunedin product. Absolutely, yeah, made right locally downtown. Uh, Cotherman Dis Distilling uh, made that for yep. us and. And uh, they were really cool. Actually, delivered it right to us with our logo on the bottle, and it, you know, it's a great little partnership to kind of, you know, help the community and and also, uh, you know, build build some more Dunedin products. Well, that's cool. That's very cool. Yeah. Well, Sean, thank you very much. This is great pizza. I'm gonna take another bite before we close the show. <laughs> but fold it this way, right? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Mm. See, being in Chicago, and we're not used to that, but oh yeah. That's why you come here, so you can learn how to eat pizza the correct way. Sean, thank you very much. Appreciate your time. Love your pizza. And, excuse me, but that will end our today's episode of Tasting the City.